Next guys, let's see you guys have the guys back looking up. I never like taking the back looking up. Looking down so you can isolate them, flatten them out. Yeah. If you're looking up, we see too many guys are good with MMA gloves defending until the end of the round. And you waste a lot of energy. Or maybe they spin back in your guard and drop bombs on you the last 30 seconds and steal the round. So if you're getting there and your arms are fatiguing, you keep trying the rear naked choke, but you're looking up, something else you can go to, again, my theory of trying to really submit the guy in the last 30 seconds, is the exorcist. Okay, take his head right off the spinal box. So we got him jacked up pretty high on here, and I can't tap him. I'm gonna take one of my hooks out, my left hook out, put it underneath. I'm gonna flip his body sideways like a, like a John Jock sweep. Okay, I'm gonna, and then, this is going to come across his face like a face lock, and I'm going to take his neck, his face, the other direction. Okay, I'm going to kick up with the, the butterfly, face lock in here, hook inside this leg, lock that hip nice and tight, and take his face the other direction. Because I have him locked here. If I don't have him locked in tight, if you can land a lockdown in, that's even tighter. Okay, but you control this hip. His body, you kicked his leg the opposite way, and I'm twisting him like an S, the opposite direction. So go for that. All right. That's how you try and finish the round. Try and get that tap instead of just fatiguing yourself out and then the guy probably beats you and stand up the opening round. You haven't gotten your gas back. You haven't gotten your wind back. So if you end up in that position, I don't like to go to that position, but if you end up in that position and he has good rear naked choke defense and maybe you don't want to risk going for the kind of low percentage arm bar from the back, you can go for the exorcist because you still have pretty good back control and you might get that tap out. Try the exorcist and uh, snap some head offs. Be careful in training, but use it in your fight and email me. Let me know when you with it. Thanks. This is a boss room special. Totally stole this one. This is a boss room technique. If you can land a lockdown on that far leg though, that makes it even tighter, so put that in as well.